back to the Weather Watch now and a live look at Lakeshore Drive. We are keeping a close eye on traffic this busy travel day. Steve's here now with a check of our forecast. It's busy on the roads today. It's going to be right. busier tomorrow. But it will be one of the better weeks for travel across the board. There are no major storms. I don't think you're going to find many slick roads anywhere close by. We got the wet weather in and out of here <clears throat> earlier today. Temperatures in the 30s. That's the only thing. It's going to get colder and colder now over the next uh, several nights. Let's take a quick survey, see what's going on up north in the North Shore. Hank says, yeah, it's cold up here. It feels like it's only 26 degrees. Not a whole lot of wind blowing, but cold enough to give you signs of winter. Glenn knows that. He says, brr, at the end of his uh, report. It's only 32 is what the what it feels like out there. And we even had a mixture of snow and rain. Did it snow where you live? It snowed in parts of Indiana. Um, wet snow in the afternoon today. Let's move on. Talk about the rest of this weather story. Okay, overnight tonight, I, I think cold is more of the issue than anything else. Uh, get ready to turn the heat up again because of these freezing temperatures. Just swell up overnight tonight. Uh, cold conditions. 24 degrees in Calumet City before the sun rises. Mundelein, 21. Warrenville, same temperature. Moments. Kankakee, both at 23 degrees. Long Beach at 25 in Indiana. Uh, don't expect anything uh, that's really uh, dangerous weather or anything that's going to slow travel down to a great degree on travel day on Wednesday, unless you're going to maybe parts of upstate New York or New England. Uh, there'll be snow there up in North and South Dakota. There'll be some snow there, the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. Notice these places pretty far from us. Rain in the Pacific Northwest, but there is one area where people like to travel as it gets colder. Florida is going to have some rainy weather on Wednesday, but the whole middle third of the country is going to have uh, sunshine and dry conditions. And for us, 41 degrees on Thanksgiving Day with a light west wind, a, a little bit cooler than normal. The warmer weather moves in on Friday, so it's the day after Thanksgiving that you'll feel the big difference. Could even have uh, temperatures in the mid 50s around here on Friday afternoon. So getting back to tonight's story, uh, anybody driving through really Ohio by now or eastern parts of Michigan, Michigan toward Detroit. That's where you'll find the rain tonight. Uh, this weather system clearing us out. And here's a look at those corners of the country where we got the, the issues with rain showers for the overnight period. But tonight, 24, that's in the city. Some areas colder than that. Next seven days look pretty good, uh, at least pretty dry. 41 Thanksgiving Day. Could be a shower or two at night on Friday and then colder toward the end of the weekend. But I'm telling you, it's nice to see that much sun in a seven day around Thanksgiving. Yes, the sunshine in those 50s on Friday, mm -hmm. like that. Thank you, Steve.